Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Jasper and Citrine. In this episode, we are going to be going in to Zonama City. Here we are. It's the dead of night in the jungle. Here we are in Zonama City. Ooh. Trainer tip number 21. Having the HM Surf lets you cross deep water. Ooh. So, in this place, what I want to do is I want to find um, a Pokemon that I want to catch. And uh, to do that, we're going to put Tropius in. We're going to heal Tropius first. Oh my gosh. Nurse Joy has turned into Steve. Um, Nurse Joy, what has happened to you? It's an epidemic. All the Nurse Joys are turning into Steves. Anyways. Ooh, okay. So I'm thinking we should go... Oh! Um, this person's a Steve too. Here, wait one second. We're gonna go into creative mode and figure this stuff out. Like, what is happening? Why you? Oh, did the PNG stuff stop working? Ah, uh, this game is real buggy. Um. We're just going to ignore this, and I'll have it fixed for the future towns. Um, I don't know what the heck happened, but yeah. Oh, excuse you. Oh my gosh, I'm lagging. Okay. Ooh, we've got jungle floor ball, jungle can canopy bar, blah, 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 yes, and a safari ball. Um, I don't think I want any of those, but what I do want is these revives, because revives are really good. Um, I don't think we need any. We've already got lots of full heals, but I suppose we can get two more. Pokemon Fan Club? Oh my gosh! A move relearner. So this this guy will be really helpful. Uh, for example, we'll be able to have our Pokemon learn stuff that they lost. Um, and we can come back here in case we need to. And ooh, Fire Fang? That one is really good. We need to get that one. Rather than having fire spin we're gonna get fire fang oh i don't want to twitch let me out okay hello welcome to the pokemon fan club we're the only one in all of hachu you can join if you'd like um i don't think so but look a pikachu Ooh, look at this escape to the jungle restaurant Ooh. oh what the heck that little parrot is saying pikachu <gasps> it's mimicking all the other pokemon sounds so hello what are you selling? A strange item. I don't know what that is. Grape pudding! Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I love that. Why don't we have that? Uh, metronome, substitute, lucky punch, blah 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 blah. I think we might get some grape pudding, because first of all, delicious. And second of all, well, why not? And we'll give the grape pudding to Gloom. Now, we'll go ahead and put the lucky egg in here. Okay, sweet. So, so far, um, oh, look at that majestic Tropius fly into the air. So what I'm looking for is I'm hoping, ooh, a construction worker, hello. You're new here. Yes, yes I am. Let's go. This person is sleeping. I just ran into their house. And <laughs> Anyways, um, I think, oh my gosh, everyone is turning into Steve's. Are you a Steve? Oh my gosh, I literally don't know what happened, but like everyone is turning into a Steve. My older brother told me that there is a giant scary monster in the lake. You're lying, there isn't a big scary monster in the lake. Oh, that's freaky. Oh, look. <gasps> I heard something that I like. Come over here. I see you. Where is it? It's blending into the water. I see it, it's running away. You cannot escape from me. I will beat you with the soft sand. Where is it? I saw it. Did you guys see it? Hello? Hmm? It just straight up disappeared. It's only one block deep, but we can't go- <gasps> I hear you. You're right there! Face me! Yes, yes, yes! So we're gonna go ahead and use confusion. And... We'll be able to catch a Meryl, which I love. I captured Meryl. Okay, now we're going to go to whatever that dude's name is. 
And we're actually going to use Meryl to try to beat the gym here. Um, we'll train up all six of these Pokemon. And then that car... Oh my gosh! That car is trying to kill me. I mean, th I think we're ready to challenge the gym. I just want to train up a little bit. There are Pokemon that spawn in the water like that Meryl. So I'll be right back. And then we will challenge the gym right over there. Yeah. Bring it, you. I'll kick your butt. Okay, let's see. Oh, well, that was easy. There you go. <clears throat> okay, I am back. And it took like two hours. But look at Meryl's level. Well, not two hours. Probably, I don't know. Look at Meryl's level. I think Meryl, it literally took like two seconds. Well, not literally, but like, figure. Anyways. <laughs> So Meryl, turns out, I don't know what's up with Meryl, but it, she earned like tons of experience and that she's already level 38 and that's really surprising. And I also love leveled for alligator up. Oh, you're in my way for alligator. So what I was thinking is maybe instead of having Curlia, because Curlia is kind of useless at this point. And Meryl seems pretty good. I mean, Meryl will fall off during uh, when we start continuing on because I want to keep it um, uh, keep Meryl a Meryl instead of evolving her, which means she'll get weaker as we continue on through the map. So I'm thinking we keep all six of these guys, and then Curlia, once she evolves into Gardevoir, she can be stay with us. But I'm thinking if we have to, we'll just give up. Guard. Uh, I mean, yes. Um, and. Uh, yeah, we're gonna heal up Meryl because that was from that other Meryl battle and we're gonna go challenge the gym. Let's go. Ah, oh, look, a trainer already. Go, Flareon. Burn her oddishes into death of pure... I don't know. We're gonna go ahead and walk on top of these ferns and open that door. It's so pretty in here. And the gym leader is someone most, most people were recognized by, you know, what they look like. Um, anyways, we're gonna have, we have to, uh, oh no, oh no, oh, oh, oh. You see, if we don't, um, if we don't run fast enough, this is like, kind of like, I don't know, it's like timed, so that if you don't press the button, get on, uh, at the right point, you'll drop down below, and I'll, sh if I get past all this, I'll show you when I'm exiting. Ugh. I can do it! I can do it! <gasps> I did it! Okay, that was really difficult. Now we need to drop down on these ferns and go through. <gasps> Look at this. Bring it! My Flareon will eat all of your glooms. Yes. Tropius? I'm gonna use Ice Fin because that's like... <gasps> oh my gosh, that kicked his butt. Oh. Take that. <gasps> oh my gosh, Curlia is evolving into Gardevoir. Just as I was talking about her evol evolving into Gardevoir. Because Gardevoir is actually a decent Pokemon. It's just, it takes a bit to get up to that point, you know what I'm saying. <gasps> Look! Spin her around! <gasps> There's Gardevoir! Why is she so gigantic? Holy crap, that Gardevoir is... What? What? Oh, okay. I'm jumping on the ferns. Okay. So the tr trick here is to run rather than jumping. Oh, wait. That was the wrong way. <laughs> you know what? Screw this. I'm flying up. Flying up. I'm a cheater, but it's okay. So what you want to do with this part is just jump against this, and then you land below on top of the ferns. And then we need to jump up. Jump. And now we will fight the gym leader. And uh, I'm sure most of you recognize this person. <gasps> it's the diamond minecart. Maybe that's just like a shirt pocket? I don't know. Anyways, it's time for us to fight, Dan TDM. I don't think you stand a chance. Let's go. Scalopede? Br oh, Meryl. Oh, gosh. I didn't mean for this to happen. Oh, no. Um, switch to like... Um, oh, Gardevoir, right here. Okay, we're going to use... Gardevoir, you need to do this. Use confusion. You suck, Gardevoir. Oh my gosh, it's more useful to have Meryl. He has a Meryl, and this Meryl is like the, his best Pokemon, so we can't use, um, you know, but yeah. So what we want to do instead 
is use uh, gloom and heal gloom up so that way when we we can put her uh, paralyzed Meryl dang it <gasps> what oh my gosh Dan is kicking my butt because we don't have anything else I think maybe use crunch instead get a chance of like <gasps> we killed Meryl okay well not killed knocked out but what we want to do now is use a soda pop on Flareon. And this is a difficult battle. Okay, I'm going to pull out Flareon because Flareon will be really good against Sunflora. And so we're going to use Overheat. And we just want to keep using Overheat because at that point it's... <gasps> we beat him. We beat Dan TDM. You've won the battle. Oh my gosh. <gasps> We've got the HM Surf. Okay, one second. We need to put our badge, our Earth badge. Ooh. And we've also got Solar Beam. And well, that's it. We're gonna go ahead and put, oh my gosh. We already have Solar Beam, but that's okay. We have Surf. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull out for Alligator, and for Alligator can learn Surf. And now that he learns Surf, I can ride on top of him. So do that. Now that, oh my gosh, this is exciting. Okay, so let's unlock Route 10. <gasps> Route 10 is unlocked. Anyways, we've unlocked we've unlocked Route 10, and technically we can go in the water now. Even with that, since we have HM Surf, even if we're not riding a Pokemon, we can go in this deeper water. So let's ride for Alligator. So for Alligator, let's ride. Anyways, guys, atop my for Alligator. Next episode, we will travel to Route 10. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.